So, those of you who watch my channel know that I don't typically do political videos, but I came across Donald Trump's major announcement today, and I just had to speak on it. So, if you haven't seen it, here it is. Birth certificate, or whatever it may be. Now, many, many people have questions, and very serious questions. I have a deal for the president, a deal that I don't believe he can refuse, and I hope he doesn't. If Barack Obama opens up and gives his college records and application, and if he gives his passport applications and records, I will give to a charity of his choice, Inner City Children of Chicago, American Cancer Society, AIDS Research, anything he wants, a check immediately for five million So there you have it. The sitting president of the United States of America is being asked to provide, yet again, his passport, his passport application, his college records, as well as his college application. Presumably this is more along the lines of the birther movement, and they are also again trying to raise the fact that Barack Obama was not born in America, although he was born in Hawaii, which has been part of the United States for a very long time. So I don't know. I also feel like it may be the age-old situation where an African-American is being asked to prove themselves that they somehow belong and they were able to get to their job or their position in school based on merit versus affirmative action. And I've had to deal with this in the workplace and I've had to deal with it in college and in graduate school because I was in, you know, various different different programs with people that didn't think I belonged and didn't think that most of the minority students were supposed to be there. Or even people in the workplace that feel like you're somehow taking their job and you shouldn't be in that position because you're not as smart as them. So I don't know. I feel like this is kind of both. It's the birther movement as well as the age-old situation where African Americans are being supposedly thought of as in their role because of affirmative action. But I just hope nobody is really taking this seriously and that when you do get out and vote on November 6th, you won't let something as foolish as this sway you. And if you do have questions about Barack Obama or Mitt Romney, they have both written books and you can feel free to pick them up, get them online, pick them up at your local bookstore and read all about their life and instead of letting something like this become an issue in your decision. I just had to speak on it because I think this is so foolish and I guess Donald Trump must have a TV show coming out or some new project that he's working on that he's trying to get attention for because this is just a ridiculous, foolish argument and something being raised at the most ridiculous time after this man, President Obama, has been sitting in office since 2008. I just don't understand the consistent barrage of people trying to make it seem like our president is somehow not legitimately an American. And it just offends me, and I hope it offends you too. Please get out and vote on November 6th.